Great Pacific Garbage Patch is a giant collection of litter in the Pacific Ocean. It is one of six giant collections of the trash in the world's oceans. Animals who live in the ocean can be harmed swimming through it. These animals might even eat this garbage thinking it's food. Just the Pacific Garbage Patch alone is 6.1 million kilometers. The trash isn't just floating on top of the water, it goes all the way down to the bottom of the sea. It contains 3.5 million tons of trash, that's 7 billion pounds. We were worried about all of the plastic water bottles we used in the class every day, and then we saw a picture of the Great Pacific Garbage Patch in the ocean. We also saw pictures of how plastic in the ocean made animals sick and uncomfortable. So we wanted to learn how to help solve this problem. First, we looked at why there's so much plastic in the sea. The people in cities normally use plastic for everyday activities. It's handy and cheap, so we use it very often. For example, plastic bags and store packaging makes carrying items easier. Most of all plastic litter is single-use plastic. This means this plastic is only used once. Single-use plastic should always be recycled, but some of this plastic is not able to be recycled like styrofoam. Single-use plastic is a big problem in poor countries because they don't have money for recycle programs. Once plastic is made, it never really disappears. The stronger the plastic, the longer it lasts. Just one plastic bottle can take over 450 years to decompose and a thousand years for a plastic bag. We shouldn't litter because if we do, it will go in the ocean and only some of the plastic will decompose. All big pieces of plastic floating in the ocean will turn into microplastic. Microplastic is five millimeters or smaller. That is smaller than a dime. Sun exposure is what breaks down plastic into smaller pieces. These small pieces of plastic can be mistaken for food and eaten by fish and birds. Sea animals die from eating plastic and they can suffocate in plastic bags. Please reuse plastic bags. Some animals eat the plastic and it builds up their stomach so they don't want to have food for proper food. Sea turtles, dolphins, whales, sea lions, and many other seabirds are becoming endangered from plastic pollution. We can reuse plastic and make fun things instead of hurting animals. Marine life is harmed because of plastic as it can choke them. Whales, fish, Seabirds and seals die because of plastic as it blocks up their digestive system. Plastic hurts marine life. Plastic is dangerous to humans because sea animals can mistake plastic as food. Humans eat fish, so it harms humans as well. Plastic hurts animals because they eat plastic and think they are full, so they starve to death. Here are the reasons why we don't want people littering. Litter ends up in the ocean because people litter and the wind blows the plastic in the, into the ocean. Do you know how many plastic ends up in the ocean? 14 billion pounds of it. It takes up to a thousand years for a plastic bag to go away. Watch out if fallen leaves fall on your property because when there are storm drains, the leaves would clog other drains. Storm drains prevent flooding streets. If trash goes in storm drains, the litter can go through the ocean and harm sea animals. America is second worst polluter in the world. Next, developed countries cannot afford recycle programs. Recycling in the process of converting waste materials and objects into new products and uses. We can recycle glass, paper, cardboard, metal, plastic, and electronics. Pick up litter, it would make our environment look good. Don't litter, it will 
will attract bugs and rodents. We should pick up plastic wherever we see. We should use paper straws or bags because plastic kills 100,000 marine animals every year. We should bring bags to a grocery store because if we don't, we'll use more plastic. We can do a lot to help. We can help by doing in beach or community cleanups. We can make difference when each person does something to help.